Good morning, children. How are you? I hope you had a great week. I hope you and your par parents are doing well. And thanks for um, tuning in to Children's Church this morning. So today's lesson that's going to be spoken about and preached about during the service um, comes from the Bible, and it comes from the book of Mark, which is one of four Gospels, one, two, three, four. Gospels is a special kind of book from the Bible that tell the story of Jesus. So what I'd like to do, if I could first, is um, share a story with you that I think uh, is really relevant to the Bible story today. So let me see if I can do that. See what happens. So some of you may have seen this story. Once I'm not sure, there was a baby hippo. It's about a baby hippo. And I heard heard of in Africa was there with his the mom. The hippos lived where um, a river you know, flowed into the ocean. Heard, uh, One family, day, a, a huge wave came and washed and the hippos away. Except for one baby washed hippo, all the hippos who away. was stranded on and a reef. The hippo ended up eight miles away from the his local home, people all rescued the baby he hippo and brought him to the beach. In Africa. And they with named the, help of the a man hippo named Owen, Owen after one of the rescuers. Like a but what do you do um, with the baby rest, hippo who's all alone? You the, can't put him with other wild hippos because they will accept him. Um, in terms of so, being able to find other Owen hippos was taken to a nature park um, he is where he family. was released in a um, safe so place to, uh, a to be cared for by preserve, people who know where the about hippos. Of the preserve was worried because there weren't any other but hippos he there. Wasn't but the then only something really animal there. And that was it was also a home to a tortoise, a tortoise named Mizay. Mize means wise old man. And he was old. Oh, I'll tell you. 130 years old. From the very first day, Owen so followed Mizay wherever he went. So sure when suddenly this baby Maybe he liked the tortoise hero. because he was big Shows and round, checking like out. another hippo. And Owen wanted to follow Mizay around for whatever reason. Mizay didn't, didn't like really having like a tag along hippo. No. Mizay at mm. first wasn't so sure. But since Mizay was slow, the time, there the wasn't much really he could do to get away from Owen. Because turtles get moved very fast. Mizay couldn't really get away. After a few days, two of them got Mizay away, got used to having Owen around. Special. And then, Mazay the began to follow after, after Owen. Owen had been following Mazay everywhere, it flipped, and Mazay started following Owen. Mazay even showed Owen Mize the leaves he liked to eat. Owen in this new home and they were Owen liked they them the too. Mm -hmm. Here's how you can take care of yourself. Without words, Mazay showed Owen a way to say, let's go. And then, really special, I think, Mazay started to understand what Owen was and one yard, day, um, Owen just what they said it to Mizay. The they even started going into the water together. They went into the Swimming water and together. hung out together. So, um, special relationships are in the form. And they took naps right? together. An mm -hmm. and a turtle. And 130 years old. No one ever could have imagined no that such different animals could become friends. friends. But, but they end, did. They became incredibly special to each other, and I would say that Mize and Owen became family. So why that's important is today's Bible verse, and this is from Jesus, who said it to his disciples, including his family was there at the same time, and what Jesus said to them was, whoever does God's will is my brother and sister and mother. So I know most of you have family, right? You have moms, you have dads, you have sisters. What Jesus was saying is, as a family of God, as the people of God, we need to be here for each other. So that if one of us gets into trouble, finds him or herself alone, like Owen did, we need to be like Mize, and we need to take them in, and we need to treat them as family and support them as family. Will you pray with me? Lord Jesus, thank you for showing us a 130-year-old turtle and a one-year-old baby hippo and how they can become family. Help us to do your will and to treat all others around us like family in the same way. Amen. Well, I hope you and your family and everyone around you has a great day. 
great week. And if you find a way, try to act like Mazay this week to someone who's in God's family. Try to treat someone special and welcome them into your life. Have a great week. Love you.